God, that is a good looking boss. Well, there's Xenos. Oh my God, is he gonna absorb him? What's left? Well done, my preparations are complete and I stand ready to seal Zodiac once more. The Watcher. Withdraw now from this place. The teleporter will deliver you to safety. <laughs> Incomplete and insufficient. Of course he was no match. Dude, he's dead Once and he's again. You have left my best laid plans in ruins. Dude, Fan Daniel's literally dead and he's still RPing. Plus one. And played your role to perfection. Thus, seeing my victory. What? I killed you. From the first, all I wanted was for you to kill Zodiac. Twice but one of many methods to achieve the desired effect. Twould have been the same had Zeno died in my place. But what better and more satisfying way to ensure success than to take control myself? Because he wants the end of days, so the primal's being gone probably brings it. Is he the my core as well? Is that you live to tell the tale? Even so, I have fulfilled my heart's desire. Yeah, why did he fight me then? Let your murder mark the beginning of the end. The coming of the final day! Dude, this Exodia looking head ass, bro. <laughs> well, you're probably wondering how I got here. How quickly strength fades and blood cools. Old familiar sensations. Dude, why'd this just turn into Hatifo boyfriend? So many lives. So many deaths. No different this. I close my eyes and slip into the dreamless slumber. There's no way Fan Daniel's actually dead. Come on, I love him. A tired song and dance. Routine. Always I wait. But not this time. <laughs> Nothing left unsaid. Nothing left undone. Inherit my hell. I intone with glee. The man I was would weep for what I have become. The all-consuming contempt. But I've the wisdom of ten millennia to justify my answer to the question. No value in their existence. Not a wit. For all that I looked. None that I did see. A final chance, then, for Heidelin and her faithful. In cataclysm, prove me wrong. I sneer. All shall
shall return to nothingness. As was your will, Emperor Sunday. I, the star, and every living being consigned to your oblivion. Holy fucking hell. <laughs> I kind of want to watch that again. There's so much going on there. Holy fucking shit. Damn. What a beautiful death. Yo, first of all, I just want to say his outfit went really fucking hard. Oh shit, we ain't done with the Lord. Ah. <laughs> At last. I knew it! Y'all were high on Heidel and you tempered idiots! Fuck this bitch! Slow and steady. Remember when he when Thor down looked at us? Oh, what are you? You saw it too, yes? The blue star below. Thrown into turmoil. Oh dude, I was fucking right! Dude, Heidelin! Heidelin! Heidelin is imprisoned in the earth! The earth is an egg, bro! The earth is a fucking egg, dude! She's imprisoned in the fucking earth, bro! She's dead ass! I said that shit! I'm fucking right, dude! The earth is a fucking primal jail cell, bro! I called it! Dude, where is the next expansion even gonna take place if we kill her? There's not gonna be a moon! There's not gonna be a fucking earth! We're gonna have to go to a different fucking planet, bro! We're gonna, oh my god, that's why there's the spaceship in the Final Fantasy. Dino, it's okay. It's okay, Dino. That's why That's why there's literally a spaceship. Because the next expansion is going to take place on another planet. And we're going to go with the fucking dragons. The dragons are going to go with us to another planet. Dude, but wait, why does Midgar smart? Why does Midgar like Heidelin? If anything, he should fucking know. I called everything. I literally called everything. Dude, I called everything. Holy shit. Then it was no illusion. All was truth. I called I called literally every single fucking bit. Dude, I fucking holy shit. I called it all. Thank you for the five months. When the death of Zodiac. With the death of Zodiac, the laws of nature over which he presided have begun to unravel. The final days are upon us. Okay, I really want to know what the final days really fucking were. Oh, wait. I might have been wrong about a couple of details. Wait, okay, I was, wrong. I was wrong about a thing or two. I, I forgot, I, I had a lab suggestion for a second. Okay, 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 okay. That, okay, so one of the things was, <laughs> okay, this chat bubble was very informative. I, I should have waited just a second. I should have waited a second before, before I said, now with the current clues, my deductive reasoning inside of my crystal palace has led to a, a different conclusion. Um, I still don't like Heidelin though. She's a primal. You can't trust primals, man. Adorn them in your crystals and ether. Anybody who doesn't agree with me is tempered, man. I, I, I'm telling you, you're all fucking tempered as shit. You with your cack W's. Look at, look at the fucking mirror. Look at the fucking mirror. Remove was cool. Yeah, true, 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 true. Okay, I want to know why the final days happened. The final days was happening even before the primals. Van Daniel's motive is still a little bit uh, obscured too, right? Okay, so now with no Zodiac. 
There has never been a period in time where Hydaelyn existed without Zodiac. Think about that. So, this is some crazy out of balance shit. And I wonder if she instantly gets more powerful? Because, right, like, the whole thing was is that there's, like, that ebb and flow between them. Which, which I think is a little bit, um... It is interesting because Zodiac existed first, right? So, you know, Zodiac is just basically a soul furnace. Feed daddy. Jump on in. Drink the fucking Kool-Aid. It's Jonestown, boys. And we're gonna get all of our dead friends back, but we just have to... Everybody just has to die first, and then we get what we want, and then we go into a spaceship, and blah, 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 Heaven's Gate. Cool. But Heidelin comes along... She sunders everything, and then that creates the balance. So she's inherently there to create the balance. Now, now what happens when it's primal's gone wild now? Nobody's going to keep the queen in check. What you witnessed was an omen granted by the Echo, a vision of the horrors to come. I don't trust it. I, I, I actually don't, I don't, I don't, tr I, I don't actually, uh, I, I, I don't trust, I don't trust that. I don't trust my echo. I trust my, my manly intuition. Time grows short. The fuck do you say to me? <laughs> What'd you call me? What? Xenos? Show me your stand, best friendo. Uh-oh. He looks like he's glowing. Did he suck upon the ether of thine fallen foe? Dude, finally. He sucked up Van Daniel. Yeah, this looks bad. Please do not rotate the bus. I am currently trying to get my positional off. I am enshrouded, said Xenos. No. I'll find no fulfillment in a contest with you this day. He's looking pretty strong. Dude, I'm getting somebody time out Mad Ark for five minutes. He went, actually, there are no positionals when you are enshrouded. I don't fucking... Take, take your, your, your Gib and Gallows and shut the fuck up. Your, your class is literally overpowered. I don't give a fuck about you. I literally don't give a fuck. <laughs> Red equals strong. True. Slavering beasts gather at your gates, ravenous and eager. Already you turn to them and away from me. I must go forth once more in search of power far beyond the might of Shinryu. Power to make your heart run over with rage. My heart's definitely doing something, baby. It definitely is doing something. You juicy motherfucker. For the eldest of primals was a betrayal of promise. A pathetic creature incapable of inspiring true despair. I... That's what I crave. Pure, unadulterated despair. Dude, has anybody just taken these lines and instead of playing the music in the background that's currently going on, just played like fucking porn ass music? Like just like bounce, bounce, wow. Hey, that's what I crave. Pure, unadulterated despair. Dude, he's so hot. Hope will win the day. I will not fight for your amusement. Hope will win the day. I will fight for your amusement. Let's wrestle. God, I look badass. We shall see. 
Somebody just said no more rejoining. Zodiac is dead. Dude, that actually makes me sad. Now when I kill people, it's pointless. Now I don't get to say rejoined. It's not necessarily true, though. Because uh, the sundering... The sundering was done by Heidelin. Zodiac isn't... So you're actually wrong, but it was a good comment. Heidelin's the bitch that tore us apart. Zodiac's just the pussy that lost. She's calling the shots, man. She's calling the fucking shots. We shall see. Respect, mother. No! Don't walk away when you hear me say Dude, look back. Oh no, he's way too cool to look back. He's way too cool to look back. Alright. Alright. Well, I think it's safe to say that that's probably the quickest start out of any of the Final Fantasy XIV expansions. Do you think that that's, a, that's an objective truth that's relatively f easy to agree upon? Dude, at this point, at this point inside of uh, Stormblood, we were literally doing chores for fucking useless. Holy shit, man. This one starts off with a bang. It certainly fucking does. I go bathroom. I go bathroom real quick. <laughs> da -da -da. Ow! Oh, fuck my asshole. Jesus fucking Mary and Joseph. Oh, oh. oh, why is there a weight on the middle of the fucking floor, man? Ow. I forgot about magic. I forgot about magic. Yeah, magic. That's how that works. Magic. True. Thank you for affording me this short reprieve. He takes so fucking long to talk. Jesus fucking Christ. This guy is stalling away. Moons aren't a requirement for a planet. Clearly not what I was fucking saying. You're gonna have a huge fucking difference. It is difference. we who should thank you. Shut up. The records stored here are nothing short of extraordinary. Don't you think adding a moon might change some shit? You know, somebody said, bro, this is a fantasy game. Dude, if it was a fantasy game, wouldn't I be surrounded by hot half-cat women all the time? Wait. Ooh, flashback. Moon dust. Seer? I think you left your moon dust. Long ago, before the Great Sundering. There was but a single world. A theor a theories. Okay. There's some Greek shit going on here, man. I know I'm not su supposed to know this. This is like the only thing that's been spoiled to me, but that flower's name, El Piss. At first, I thought it was Spanish for the piss. But then I started thinking about some of the other Greek shit that's going on. I, 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 potentially, potentially spam, spam some other shit in the chat right now. But I was like, El Piss. And I was like, damn, they really didn't try on that one. They could have called it La, La Shit. But I started thinking, man, maybe that shit's Greek. And there's a bunch of other Greek shit going on. A theorist, I, I don't know. I don't know. I think it's interesting that there's all this Greek shit going on, when on top of that, there's a bunch of other cultures being brought into play. I just think it might be important a little bit. No Elpis, no Elpis. What is that? One day from within the earth, a terrible cry issued forth, affecting a profound change in all manner of life. Oh, okay. This is the, okay, flashback to the final days. 
One day, from within the earth, a terrible cry issued forth. It was a screech that changed it all? Damn, that's a freaky looking motherfucker. And on that day, it all changed. That's when the fire nation came. Oh, now it's turned into Miskip stream. We were not exempt. Our creation magics ran rampant, giving shape and form to thoughts of hopelessness and despair. At first, the phenomena was limited to a single region, but quickly, so very quickly, it spread and engulfed the whole of the star. Dude, th this place reminds me of Mo Moira's house in the Dark Crystal. The etheric energies, which flow through all of creation in the form of various currents. The currents which course through the land and seas. Those which flow through the very air. and those of a celestial nature which encompass both our star and this moon. This is like a hole in the magic ozone layer. Maybe their creation magics were pulling from the celestial ether and then basically they closed like a magic climate change and they punched a hole in the ozone because of their fuel source for the creation magic and uh, their own magics caused their un own undoing. They set, they set the planet out of homeostasis and, and the remaining a aether on the planet like runs wild. And that, that's what it, what, what happened, man. I sound like a libtard. All right, let's see. Sorry. I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm not actually a political dude. I'm not actually a political dude at all. I, just, I was just like, I was just kidding. I was just kidding. I was just kidding. <laughs> man, I'm gonna make his son pissed off twice today, man. <laughs> Bring ruin to the source, and its reflections will share in its fate. Thankred knows. I, I feel like one of the reasons Thankred got sad is because he knows if he fails, Reen isn't safe. But maybe I'm reading into that too much. But thank you for it. Ah, it is ready. This way, if you would be so kind. Dude, I, I, I think that this thing's. This expansion. There's no way that this doesn't end up being the best expansion. <laughs> like, this is so ridiculous. A beautiful sight, is it not? Heidelin knew better than any that her power was not absolute. Indeed, she would has ever struggled to hold Zodiac and his faithful at bay. She doesn't know. Who is she talking to? She feared the worst, and she made preparations. In the event of his demise, there would be a contingency. Oh, shit. This moon is more than a prison. It is a vessel capable of bearing the people of theories to safe harbor. It's a spaceship! Because the moon's a spaceship. I, I kind of thought... That this looked like a piece of cheese the whole time. It's literally moon. The moon is cheese and the spaceship is cheese. Oh shit. It's like a little bit of a cut scene. Wow. Onward. Dude. Holy shit. It's the beginning of cataclysm. Now the ether yet permeates from the crater. Remnants of... Fuck. Remnants of Zodiac most likely. Dude, I, I wanna I wanted to like live edit turn on uh the Final Fantasy or not Final Fantasy, the never ending story song right now. Turn around 
Look at what you see the visions of a dream Just a little bit further mm, 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 mm. Riding home Whoa, didn't see that there This literally is just Cataclysm But it makes sense And not terrible And the gameplay's good And it wasn't made by terrible people And the PvP's probably worse This structure is enormous. I've heard that before. Ba, 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 ba. Whoa! The Justice League headquarters? What the fuck is this shit, man? Ooh. Can I attune to that? Oh shit, why can I jump? They're waiting here for me. They're they're waiting here for me. I attuned ahead of the curve. Why are you guys all on one side? To the window, to the wall. Why are you guys all on one side? What are you doing? Oh my God, it's a little bunny. I had like seen, I had seen a few of these on Twitter. Oh my God. That is my favorite. No way, there's a whole little bunny army. Wait, there's space bunnies. Okay. Dito on Dito. Holy shit. Are they clones of each other? Are they clones of each other or am I racist? Is this like a little- you're racist? Is this like a little Boba Fett army? This is actual Clone Wars but with bunnies. Look lively everyone! I know, I know, this 1,243rd inspection is a mite ahead of schedule, but it is of the utmost importance, for Zodiac, alas, is no more. Good delivery, little bunny child. As of now, our mighty moon has a new purpose, to bear the people of Aetherius to safety. To safety. <laughs> To infinity and beyond. <laughs> Dude, I'm just imagining these creatures just making like non-stop Zeppelin level bun puns. Like, it's just like non-stop stupid bunny puns, you know? To infinity and bun beyond. Our time has come, my friends. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah, yeah. We must be swifter than swift. There is much to do before our guests arrive. I feel like this character has a lot in common with me. Like this character, look, let's be swift, moving at the same pace as me and everything. This right here, this character, I mess with the bunny people. I expect your workstation to be immaculate. And don't forget to relay our signal to Etheris. Same height? Dude, what the fuck? Stop calling me stalling way. It's so fucking stupid. I don't know who even came up with it. I, I will say it's better than just saying stalling, but stop fucking calling me stalling way. Like, dude, go back to the old days of Jet Black. Let's just go back to Jet Black. Questions? Yes? No? Maybe so? No? Then hop to it! <laughs> dude, fuck it. <laughs> hop to it! <laughs> I like the Lollafell just being like, those things look it's stupid. It's a rather curious crew she have chosen. Their endearing forms intended to ease the passengers' hearts, perhaps. 
perhaps. <laughs> funny at all like it was not that funny in ARR and shit but like it, it's so fucking funny now like I, I feel like a lot of the times when you would you would like find something funny in ARR you were like not sure if it was supposed to be funny and now like the game will legitimately make me crack up they I, I, I mentioned this before too they really have used all of the tech upgrades in this one like the, the their their ability to use facial expressions their their oh my god tatru wasn't zodiac <laughs> okay okay tatru is officially i'm officially 100 sure that tatru is not zodiac but that's the thing like it's so many times throughout the throughout the story <laughs> You don't know that. You don't know that. Or he's spamming out. Or he's spamming. <laughs> Dude, the, the thing is, though, it's like early game when they didn't have the greatest tech. Every time Tatru smiled, I was sure something bad was going to happen. You know? And uh, now, like, they're they're able to, like, thank Red's face there when he was just like, perhaps. So fucking good. Voice acting's on fucking point. Man, I, I'm, I'm enjoying this a whole bunch. Hum, 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 hum. Dude, just made like a Tamagotchi noise. The leader of the crew? Not me, I'm afraid. Uh, Singing Way is the name. Oh, I get why you guys were calling me Stalling Way. Because all of their names end with Way. Oh, I get it. I get it now. Okay, so Singing Way, and you're just singing. I get it. Okay, I get it. I get it. Real fucking good. <laughs> Real fucking good. <laughs> hey, look, it's Sleeping Way. Do dozing. Blum, 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 blum. Leader? No. Sleeping Way. <laughs> Dude, these are like the fucking... Th <laughs> the Seven Dwarves. <laughs> Snow White and the Seven Dwarves, except they're fucking buddies, man. Who the fuck just said Balding Way? You're about to be banned way. Yo, mods way? Where are you? Do your job way. Come on. Three way? Oh, shut up. Meeting way. Okay. Okay, I get it. Dude, we're... I fucking get it, okay? Who the fuck just said breeding way? Oh my fucking god. No fucking way. Okay, okay. <laughs> dude, that that one is good on so many levels, dude. <laughs> Falling way. Okay, okay, okay. I feel so relaxed and so Coast Guard pissed. The Coast Guard pissed. Here, man. Coast Guard pissed. What a real man. Coast Guard pissed. man. Coast Guard I wish I was the guy on your line. Coast Guard pissed. But instead, I just motherfucking cry. Alone at night, wish I could be your little spoon.